Hey, all you world shakers. This is Uncle Dean coming at you from the Bitterroot. Uh, been a while since I've done a video. I wanted to do a little short one on it. And this uh, bench top grinder power plant that I've been building. I'm about to go that way and see if things work out. Anyway, uh, what I have found out is that this motor gets too hot. It's just not enough motor to turn this at a constant rate because of the drag that's on this from this stator. But I have found out how to tone down the voltage coming out of that stator to where it's manageable. It's not up in the 70s range. And it's down, now I got it down into the oh, around 26, 27 volts. Uh, and the way I did that is that I just put each leg coming out of the stator, you got three legs, each leg has its own rectifier. And I'm taking a positive out of one of the rectifiers and two negatives out of the other two. And uh, that puts me at just about the right range of power voltage uh, to charge a 24 volt battery system because um, if I run all three legs into one rectifier this thing would put out near 100 volts so I can, I'm going to start it up it ain't going to run very long because it's getting too hot but I'm going to start it up and show you what it's doing on the charger now it's hooked up to a 24 volt battery bit bank right now 23.79 all right here we go i got to give it a little pull so bear with me I hope you get going I was running off the generator outside not the batteries but I just want you to see what putting a rectifier on each separate leg does Yeah, right now, that, that's an ad adequate voltage right there. Now, see that, that motor starting to die off because it's starting to load. It just ain't got enough gumption to do it. Anyway, I'm going to shut her back down before it totally burns it up. But uh, that's, that's where I'm at. I've got the inverters rigged up in here. And uh, it's charging adequately. I got it down into a manageable uh, range now. So anyway, that's where I'm at. I got a, I've got an older bench grinder out in the shed. I'll uh, pull it, bring it in, and it's a, it's a big herky job. I mean, it's got some big coils and stuff in it. So it'll, I'm sure it'll have the bottom end to do what I need to do. Anyway, that's my story. I'm sticking to it. Uncle Dean coming at you from the Bitterroot Wilderness of Idaho. Living on the, on the edge and loving it. Sometimes. Know your left from your right, people. Stay in the center. Stay centered. Stay in the middle.